and the Tigers would be back at home taking on William and Mary, home sweet home for the Tigers, but they would be trying to do something that they haven't done in school history. That is beat the tribe of William and Mary, and quarterback Jake Phillips, the senior quarterback for the tribe, would have something to say about that. The D passed down the sideline, and he could go all the way. Touchdown, William and Mary. They take the early lead seven to nothing on top of the Tigers. Then trying to make something happen again. A little luck for the Tigers as the ball bounces off the William Mary receiver and into the hands of Drew Mack, the safety for this Towson team. And that would set up this run. Choo-choo, Matt Casser down the sideline. He gets all the way to about the 35 and out of bounds. And, well, Coach McGlinchey's pretty excited about that. Towson gets their first big run of the year. Then Schaefer putting a capitalization on it as he hits John Godzlowski in the end zone for the touchdown. Towson has now tied this thing at seven apiece here in the first quarter, a big or second quarter, a big touchdown for the Tigers to keep them in this game. It's now seven to seven. Then punter Bill Shears, who was a quarterback in high school, is going to fake the punt and snap it out to the receiver on the left side. Just like that, the Tigers showing a little bit of gumption here, making a big call, gutsy call. They would have to punt later, but that would also set up a William and Mary punt. It would stop inside the 35-yard line for the Tigers, setting up good field position after a holding penalty. Sean Schaefer from first and 20 finds Tommy Bro with the alley-oop in the end zone. Tommy, the center on the basketball team, but he's a wide receiver on the football team. Either way, he's putting points on the board for the Tigers as he puts Towson on top. 14-7 to with five seconds to go in the half. They were going to the half with huge momentum, huge lead, trying to take advantage of that momentum. However... You thought the Tigers would take advantage of the momentum. You were wrong. Jake Phillips going to use his legs to get outside the pocket and scramble to the left side, getting deep into Tiger territory, taking a little bit of a jolt there. But it's okay because a few plays later, William and Mary going to roll to his left and throw back to the right as Jake Phillips to a wide open receiver. That's a little misdirection against the Tigers. And just like that, William and Mary is back on top of Towson. They kick two more field goals a little bit later, and then get the ball back again on the fumble by the Tigers. The snap miss exchanged, and after the game, Gordy Combs said, I don't think that's happened to Sean Schaefer since he's been here, and he's a senior. But it happened nonetheless. A few plays later, the fire over the middle for the touchdown to William & Mary. They take the lead now 27-14 to with three minutes to go in the third quarter. Then the Tribe, adding some insult to injury, going to pound their way into the end zone with the big fellas. They go on to increase that lead and defeat the Tigers at home, embarrassing 34-14, to scoring 27 unanswered second-half points.